on day two, we started our morning heading out for an early lunch. Our old college friend was coincidentally in Georgia at the same time as us, so we decided to make time to grab a meal with her since we hadn't seen her in a while. And we stuffed ourselves with some birria tacos that were busting. After we parted ways, Joanne and I headed over to Lenox Square Mall to do some eye shopping. While walking around, I stumbled into a swatch store where I fortunately picked up the last Mission to Mercury moon swatch in stock. Later that evening, Joanne's older brother treated us to some Korean sushi. And then we headed home to call it a night. On day three, we visited a place called Krog Street Market, which had a variety of dining establishments. And afterwards, we went back to Pond City Market to scooter along the Atlanta Beltline. Oh, 
Day four, our last day, we had our final meal at a place called Tambung Nengmyeon, which was apparently the number one Nengmyeon spot in Georgia. And I have to say, I think it's rightfully number one. finally said our bittersweet goodbyes and set our course for back home in Virginia. But of course we had to make another pit stop in Blacksburg. So that concludes our Atlanta trip. Looking back, Joanna and I both agree that this was a very fun and memorable trip. Neither of us had any high expectations, but Atlanta definitely exceeded them. Truth be told, I think what makes a successful trip is seeking out good moments, having good food, and enjoying good company. So that being said, thank you for watching.